Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to boot into recovery mode on your uh, Lenovo LOQ15. So if you want to boot into recovery mode, then before we do that, let's make sure that we have access to our Microsoft account. So what we need to do is go to this website right here aka.ms slash my recovery key and it has to be this exact website so uh, make sure that there's a dot between ak and ms and there's a slash between be, before my recovery key and there's no dot com at the end because you can go into a scammer's website if you enter the non-correct version so make sure to copy the exact uh, website then i'm gonna click on go and then I'll just need to log into my Microsoft account. So um, I'll just log in quickly. And if you are logged in, then it should look so, sort of like this. As you can see here, the BitLocker recovery keys and all of that. This will be really needed in case is like we click on something and it locks our drive. So if it locks our drive, there's no way to recover it except for um, using a recovery key or replacing the whole drive, which will obviously uh, lose all your data. So um, what we have to do now, since we are sure, 100% sure that we have access to our um, recovery keys, we need to shut down our laptop Then after it shuts down, wait for additional a few seconds. And now I'm gonna flip the laptop over because we need to get to the special port, which is here. This is this hole and we need to put any needle pin or SIM card tray opener into that until it clicks. After it clicks, we can release and it'll boot up to the so-called Novo menu. So I'm just gonna turn the brightness down a bit. And then as you can see, there is uh, a few options and we need to go to system recovery. And as you can see, we are in the recovery uh, settings. So we can go to like continue to Windows 11. So we're exited and it will not even be asked about the recovery key. Uh, you can turn off PC. You'll also not be asked about the recovery key. You can use the USB drive network connection or re Windows recovery DVD to like recover your Windows or go to troubleshoot. Here you can reset your PC or go to advanced options to like a few do a few different things like for example go to startup settings then you'll be able to enable safe mode and after you click on restart you will be prompted to enter your uh, bitlocker recovery key i believe yes and as you can see we need to get to the website that we've been on so i'm gonna click on enter because it prompts me to do so then go, go to the website as shown here as we've visited a moment ago and find uh, the recovery key that uh, you can see here on the website i have device name key id recovery key drive and key upload date so um, find the key that's uh, that uh, of which the key id is the same as the first section of this recovery key id so just find the one that's appropriate. I'm gonna find you if I find one. I'm gonna show you if I find one. Uh, okay, and I have it here. So it has uh, the correct mm, key ID and here's the key. So I just need to enter it into this field. Uh, this is a very long one. And so make sure you enter everything correctly. 
And if it's correct, then you can press on enter and it'll work. Now I'm just gonna select my safe mode, so it'll be number four. Um, so I just clicked on four on my keyboard. And let's see if it boots into actual safe mode. Yes, it actually, I think, boots because it asked me, like it said that pin doesn't work. And I like, obviously it doesn't work because it needs like several things. Whatever, uh, let's try connecting to Wi-Fi if we can. Or actually we can't, so. Like I'm just gonna uh, shut down the laptop because I don't have any connection and I cannot unlock it since it's in safe mode. But I've shown you how to go to the recovery mode. So that's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.